Hi, I am Dr. Rajiv Anand, right now before you on the side of a lake in Mandai area in Singapore. Most of you keep on working so hard to save money to enjoy at some later point of time. And most of us realize that even after working hard for decades, we do not find that right time when to enjoy it. Either the money keep on remaining in the bank, we don't have time, or the money keeps on losing the value. Or the people whom we would have loved to enjoy the money with, they leave us either horizontally or vertically. So here is some very small, very subtle point. What for we earn? We have beside a bank in which we deposit money, we have another bank created by the God. And that's the bank of family. Yes, a very simple word called family. Each one of us who is gifted with a family should consider himself lucky and bless that one has a family, the near and dear ones. And they are no less than bank. Whatever good will you deposit in them, whatever good acts you deposit in them, whatever care you express in them, whatever love you express to them, whatever way you make them feel special, whatever way you make them feel accepted and appreciated and admired and important, all this is a kind of a small deposit. You remember in the childhood, all of us had the coin box and we used to deposit and due course of time that used to become big. So is a relationship bank or a family bank. The way you take care of your children, they will take care of you when they grow back. The way you take care of your, your near and dear ones, including your spouse, the spouse would take care of you back, maybe immediately, maybe later on. Haven't you noticed some senior people, elderly people, being very well taken care of, being very well respected, accepted, and loved, even if when they are 80s or in 90s? And these people are the ones who have painstakingly taken care of their children when they were young. On another hand, you have also noticed many people who have money, who have wealth or property and whatnot, and yet they have nobody and they are living like, like destitute, living like lonely life, living depressed. And many of us look at them and wonder what and where things went wrong. Is it very difficult to look into? When they were at the peak of their career, they did not take care of near and dear ones. They didn't nourish their family. So family is a God-sent opportunity, like a bank in which you make small deposits, like you've heard about SIP, mutual fund. Same way, even small deposits periodically done in family. Never go waste. It's not only never go waste. Cumulatively, it makes you a really wealthy person. My dear friends, by now, you are wise enough to know wealth does not lie in bank only. Wealth does not lie in your wallet only, it lies in your heart. So I would like to see you becoming wealthier, richer and happier, in real terms happier, not only in the bank's currency, not only in your passport. Wish you a happy life, have a great life. Thank you.